Time to play with some play. This is next to the final thing I have to do. As soon as I'm done doing this, I'm going to work on the back of his hand and that should be about the last thing I need to do on this clay. I'm using one camera and uh, that's it. just hitting it with a uh, stiff brush, a stiff oil painter's brush, and being careful not to press too hard in some areas and press hard in others. Just take out any kind of uh, markings I don't want on the uh, finished clay. I've got uh, the hand started here, back at the hand anyway, and I'm going to do a little magic here. The first thing I have to do is I'm going to use some of this uh, freezing spray super cold and I'm going to hit the uh, hand with it and now I'm not going to show you <laughs> because I will be covering this in a future uh, instructional DVD. Alright, I've got the uh, hand to the point where I can start finalizing it.
want to work around these veins that I put into the hand. That works best when they're cold. Now I've got the hand pretty much done. So now I can work on the uh, the last of the uh, things I have to do, and that's uh, do some texturing back here where it needs to be textured. And do his uh, scalp lock. Well, I don't know how much I lost on that uh, camera, the uh, Hero 5, but it started acting up. And so I switched over to uh, my, he my uh, Hero 8 camera. And uh, I've got all the, the filling in and done. On the clay, I've still got one more spot right there I need to do, and I'll do that in a few minutes. But first, I'm going to make the uh, scalp lock, and I'll be right back. Now, there's his uh, scalp lock attached. And I've got to uh, run the robe over it because it pulled on his uh, blanket that's covering his shoulder. And it's gone underneath the uh, the blanket. I got me a uh, silicone map for cooking, and I didn't realize I could use it for uh, sculpting as well. It uh, doesn't stick to the clay at all, and that's really something you're looking for when you're getting something roll clay on it just does not stick I keep forgetting I don't need to turn the whole sculpting stand. <laughs> just a matter of uh, blending in the uh, addition to the robe into the robe. I'm going to have to fill in behind it. But that's no big deal. And I'm going to fill underneath the uh, scalp lock too. Well, that's Sitting Bull, and he's finished. It's all balanced out now. I like the uh, way it turned out with the scalp lock and all that, and uh, doing all the filling in that I've had to do. I can see a couple of spots yet uh, underneath that collar behind this uh, uh, jacket he's wearing, and down inside behind that collar. So. Just a couple of things, and I'll do that off camera. I'll see you guys next time. Adios. Give me a thumbs up and share my video. And then check out my instructional DVDs, uh, the link down below this video. 
All right. See you next time.